There's a strong chance you have never heard of the first person of color to play in what would become the NBA, but today we'll share the legendary story of the late Wataru Wat Masaka. Wat Masaka was born to Japanese immigrants in Ogden, Utah, and raised in his father's barbershop basement. He experienced racism growing up, including being banned from restaurants because of his ancestry. Nevertheless, Masaka stayed committed to excellence in the classroom and in sports. In high school, he was captain of the football team, played baseball and basketball, and ran track. The hardwood is where he would shine the brightest and earn his nickname as the Kilowatt for his speed as an undersized point guard. He led Ogden High School to a state championship in 1940 and a regional championship as a senior in 1941. Masaka's winning ways continued in the college ranks. He helped lead Weber Junior College to back-to-back -back conference championships and won an NCAA title in 1944 and an NIT championship in 1947 at the University of Utah to put a bow on his collegiate career. You might be wondering about the gap between those two titles. Well, Masaka was drafted into the U.S. Army after the first and at one point stationed in Hiroshima, Japan after the U.S. bombed the city in 1945. Masaka told University of Utah Magazine Continuum, I was a man without a country. To the Japanese, I was an invader. Americans didn't trust me because I was Japanese. World War II had a massive effect on Masaka and all those with Asian heritage living in America. As the result of a 1942 executive order from U.S. President Franklin D. Roosevelt, now widely understood as a civil and human rights violation, an estimated 120,000 people of Japanese descent were incarcerated in desolate and remote parts of the United States, forced to live in barracks following the events of Pearl Harbor. After his collegiate career, the New York Knicks would select Misaka in the seventh round, making him the first non-white basketball player ever to play in the Basketball Association of America, a precursor to the NBA. Misaka told NPR in 2012, I never did think of myself as a pioneer of any sort, but Misaka indeed paved the way for so many. Wat Misaka, Trailblazer, Barrier Breaker.